Welcome guys, welcome. Welcome back to the channel. Today guys, we got, we're finally going to get to make a video with this truck. It's just did release the new Mac Anthem uh, earlier this week. Uh, we got a day cap version of the truck here. We, we got the new food trailer that did come with 1.7. We're hauling some fruit juice. We got 202 miles to go. We're using, we got a Mac engine in this truck. 500, I believe it's 505 horses, has a 12 speed Mac transmission with a retarder. So let's get on the road and take a look at this beautiful truck. Here's the interior of this truck. Now, the day calves in this, in this Mac uh, it does not have a GPS. Uh, I'm assuming that's the way it is in real life. I've never been in one of these trucks. Uh, so you will not get a GPS for this truck in a day cab version. Got the window down. A bit a little noisy. But I am enjoying the truck. It's a really, it's a good looking truck. Uh, you know, it's another one of these, um, trucks that it's just done a good job with. We're going to get a thumbnail pretty soon because we're going to be getting dark on us. Wanted to get in here and show off the Mac. Wanted to also show off the new food trailer that comes from 1.7. Uh, we do have the gold bulldog on the hood. Cause this is a full Mack truck. This does not have uh, the Go Bulldog means that you have a Mack engine, Mack transmission. And that's what this one has. And I wanted to do a day cab for this truck and I thought it would look better with this food trailer. You know, like a 70 inch sleeper version of this truck. There are three versions. There's a day cab, there's a 43 inch sleeper, and a 70 inch sleeper. I will show you all the options and everything once we drop this load. Of which you can get with this truck. But I'm really enjoying it. I've, I've got a 70 inch sleeper, uh, one of these on, on here in the game, and I'm enjoying the truck. Get cut down on some of the traffic mods right now, guys. I'm, I'm kind of waiting for uh, some things to update. And we're going to ahead and get a thumbnail. The reason why I'm going to go ahead and get it now is because it's going to be getting dark on us for long. Because it's like almost 7 o'clock in game time. So I better go ahead and get a thumbnail. While we still have some light. So we can see this truck. Kind of get the trailer in there too. A little closer. Yeah, there we go. That'll work. Now this will be the first run that I've done where I've recorded with this truck. I have been running it, like I said, I do have a 70 inch sleeper version of the truck in, in the garage. I've been driving. I 
But I thought it would be good to get in here and kind of show y'all both at the same time. The food trailer and the uh, new Mac. So, I mean, hopefully, you know, we'll see the, the Freightliner, you know, this year. You know, since they might come out early, you know, maybe we'll see the Freightliner. You know, we're getting two states, maybe we'll get two trucks. Hope everyone's doing well. Hope you've been enjoying the videos. I've uh, been taking a little bit of time off from um, posting. I was uh, I've been looking for some work opportunities that will kind of fit my schedule, and I finally found something. I don't know if I'm going to stay there, but um, for now, you know, I've, I've found something that I'm going to be doing. It still kind of fits my schedule. He is a good looking truck though. And uh, if you did not know, which, but obviously I didn't know this myself, but uh, the Bulldog on front of this truck is gold. And if, it, if, it, if you see one with a gold Bulldog like this, that means that it's pure Mac. It, it means it has a Mac transmission, Mac engine. You know, it, it's it's a pure Mac truck. You see one with like a Nago, like Chrome. It means the truck has like a Cummins diesel or Detroit diesel or you know a Caterpillar engine with a eating full of transmission, something like that. So I wanted to keep it pure. Take a look at this truck before it gets dark. Look, we're running on the road. Whoa. There we go. So hope everyone's doing well. Hope everyone's staying safe, enjoying the videos, enjoying the uh, stuff that you know I've been putting out. A lot of the other YouTubers uh, been putting out. One of my favorite YouTubers is back, so I've been watching his stuff, which is uh, Barry Bugs. He is back. Uh, glad to see him. He has come back. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, to making videos. Yeah, um, and he did say that he uh, now he's not making them every day, but he wants to get back into where he does make them every day, and that's something that I'm trying to do also. And you see, this truck does have the work have the working windows for 1.7.
this will be the first video with a truck. Man, I mean, um, you know, no offense to mods, but uh, there is some mods in this truck out there. And it's just done a good job. Now, I've heard some complaints about the mirrors, the side mirrors. Um, I don't know if they're like that in real life. <coughs> I've heard a lot of people say the mirrors are in the way. I've never drove one of these in real life, so I don't know if they, uh, if, uh, they are like that in real life or not. But I can see where people uh, would say that. They are in a weird position, but you know, maybe that's the way it is in real life. I'm all over the road up here. We ain't dealing with this. We're going around. Ooh, I don't know what that lag was. I apologize for that. I'll have to look and see what that is. Maybe a traffic mod. Load of pipes. Lost a load of pipes. Guys, I normally don't leave the map up, but I'm leaving it up today since we're in a, a day cab that doesn't have a built-in GPS. I have one over there in the corner, but I can see that one down there a little bit better. So this is going to be kind of a short run with this truck. If you want to see more of the little day cab, let me know. We'd be happy to run it some more. I don't know what that is. I apologize for that. I don't know what that is. It wasn't doing that. Go straight on. It's 
It's gotta be a traffic mod. I might look into it. Could be Jackie Cat's trailer pack too. I'll have to look into what's causing it. I'm using Jackie Cat's trailer pack. Could be that too. We're about there, we got about five miles. I don't know why we're taking this uh, whole load of fruit juice to Walmart, but okay. Good look at the truck, man. Eh? One thing good about using a day cab, you can turn it better.
Don't hit the pole. A little bit crooked, huh? Can we bump the dock? Let's see if we can bump the dock. Yeah, there we go. Well, what do you say we bumped it? Alright. Salute. Alright, excellent. We drove 203 miles. It took us 4 hours, 57 minutes to get here. Consume 41.3 gallons of fuel. Hey guys, I want to show you the options for this Mac. Um, so, we'll go to the dealer here. Mac. The only dealer I found is in Fresno, California. So we'll go there. Online. Alright. So you have, you have two versions of the, of the day cab. You have uh, one with the, um, on top. The wing on top. Then you have this one. You have a 48 inch sweeper and you have a 70 inch sweeper of the truck. So we're going to look at the 70 inch sweeper version. This is your 70 inch sweeper. As you can see there is three. And you have uh, this will have your large uh, chassis. You have different sizes. You, this is a uh, 6.4 large. It has a 28.4 gallon tank. That's 6.2, 24 gallon. That's a 6.4, 23.4 um, gallon fuel tank. This is your engines. Um, does have Mac engines. Uh, the engine that we are running in ours is the Mac MP855 G. Do have some modded engines also. In here, um, you know, these are modded engines. This is a modded engine pack. Um, do have some Detroit diesels? Here are some Cummins uh, engines. Um, yeah, more Cummins. A lot of Cummins engines. There's some CAD engines that's been updated as mods for the truck. So 
lot has been updated for the for this truck. You know, already been updated. As far as the engine packs, there's quite a few engine packs. Um, the transmission is like a said range. You do have a Eaton Fuller 18 speed. This is a 12 speed Mac engine, which is in the truck. I mean, this is a 12 speed Mac transmission, which is in it already. Uh, you have a 6 speed Allison. You have a 7 speed. Uh, that's an 8 speed Allison. Uh, the largest Mac transmission that I found is a 12 speed of a retarder. This in here. Um, you have. As far as the interior goes, you have four options here. This is like a, your standard interior. And you see this does not have a GPS. This is your um, prime interior. Okay, your prime elite extra injury and now you see your GPS for the gray interior this is the ultimate it's a very good looking truck very good looking truck so that's your interior option uh, you have basic colors, you have white, you have uh, the granite gray, matte, matte black, uh, cobalt blue, red green, liquid silver, it's all your, um, you know, your custom colors, custom matte colors, all your SCS um, colors, you know, that they've done with all their trucks. For the truck, you have um, a. Get it quick, on it. Come on. You have your banners. If you want to hollow a wide load with it, you can do so. You have three bumpers. You have the bumper standard. You have the bumper chrome which is still painted, but it has the chrome right there, like that. And then you have a fully chrome bumper, large chrome bumper, which to me, the painted bumper looks better on this truck. Um, yeah, as far as the grill, you have two options. You have the standard and the chrome grill. Chrome grill looks good on it. You have, and like I said before, this is your hood ornaments. You have the the regular bulldog and the uh, gold bulldog. You have three uh, mirror options. You have the standard, you have the painted, and the chrome. <coughs> Alright, this is your air intake right here. Your air filter. It has a chrome and a standard version. This is uh, for your flags. There. Up here's your sun risers. You have a uh, standard, you have chrome with lights, you have standard, this is your painted. Standard, uh, you see, and this is the chrome. You also have, um, right here with your lights, I don't know if we chose this, we're going to show you this. You have a chrome, you have your standard and chrome for your light fixtures there. Your mirrors, you have, uh, standard, painted, you have painted mic and go and chrome. Painted mic means you have a gold, uh, bulldog on them on the, on the mirror. You have a um,
two options with doorknobs. You have standard and chrome. This is your exhaust. You have uh, one below, one single pipe, and one double pipe exhaust option. This is your um, side kicks of the truck. You have aluminum tanks, you have painted and chrome steps, you have chrome tank steps, uh, you have chrome, you have painted and chrome D side steps. Um, quite a few options here. Um, this is a uh, door handle here. Uh, you can put a chrome door handle here, this little door here. Side reflector, it has uh, quite a few options for that. If you want to add a side reflector to the truck, you can do that. Do and then you have chrome uh, handles back here that go on the side reflector. This gives you a... Um, Make these handles here chrome. That's your exhaust. Uh, headache racks, you have two options. You have your standard and chrome. And you have a um, Mud guards for the back. You have three standard painted in chrome. And you have plenty of mud uh, guards. You have the uh, <coughs> standard, two types of stand, three types of standard, and uh, you have uh, three of your elite uh, ones, all Mac different light designs on it. Uh, as far as your tires go, you have a quite of the, you have the normal basic selection, you have four tires. Selection, you know, the Icoas, Codemasters, um, uh, you have your standard, um, All, all these types of rims. I, I, also, you can use Viper's uh, rims on here. The Alcoa's <coughs> from Viper's um, selection. Same for the front, you know, bunch of tire options. Oh, excuse me, not tire options. Um, rim options. You have quite a few rim options for the truck. Okay, up here you can do, it's your beacon, you want a beacon. Now if you want to add like a top cup, <coughs> excuse me, a roof cup to this truck, you can do that. like that. And then your interior on the inside. Um, you know, you have all your steering wheels, options that comes with them. Um, then your the SISL uh, mod pack works for this truck. It's been updated, so it does work.
Alright guys, that's going to be it for the video. I just want to get in here and show off the new Mac Anthem. SCS has released it. And we do have the food trailer that come out with 1.7 update for the game. A little short little run that will use the day cab version of the truck. It is a good looking truck. I, I can't say that. It does stand out. So thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And have a good day.